In his Renewed Hope agenda, President Bola Tinibu paid special attention to equitable access to healthcare services to all Nigerians, irrespective of social status. In her courtesy visit to Alliance Hospital, the Senior Special Assistant to the President on Humanitarian Affairs and Poverty Alleviation, Honorable Delu Yakubu, says, based on the track records of Alliance Hospital, on response to emergency services and rendering free treatment to the vulnerable Nigerians, the presidency has endorsed and adopted the Hospital for Humanitarian Services. Humanitarian works of your hospital speaks volume out there. That's why we're here. At least we have so many hospitals in Nigeria, but for us to single-handedly pick you out, you know what it means. I will surely pass your message to the presidency and see how the government can, one way or the other, support your work because to get your type is rare now. In his response, the MD of Alliance Hospital, Dr. Christopher Tabot, outlines the array of free health services the hospital has rendered to Nigerians, which ranges from free knee surgeries, spine surgeries, among others. Every year in the past five years, we have saved Nigeria nothing less than $100 million. The spine surgery, if that surgery was to take place in the U.S., it's $150,000. But the patient being poor, I had to give a discount until we got to 4.5 million. The, there's a very large room for collaboration and we must explore it to the benefit of the Nigerian public. A few days ago, the FRSC endorsed Alliance Hospital as a key emergency response hospital. Joseph Kadri, ITV News.